We start tonight with winter weather staring us down. Hope you're staying safe tonight. I'm Brad Bird. And I'm Shelley Kirk. What did your commute look like heading into work this morning? Well, we were on the scene of several accidents, including one that became deadly. Eyewitness News' Katie Forque joins us live at 5 with more on this. Katie? Hey, Shelly and Brad. Yeah, that's right. I'm here off of the Lloyd, and as you can take a look here behind me, traffic does seem to be moving pretty good through here. Cars are moving pretty easily with no real hazards on the road in terms of wet weather. I noticed, though, in terms of my commute this morning into work, it was definitely a little slick in some spots. We did catch up on the scene of some accidents from this morning's weather. Take a look. Traffic backed up to one lane after three cars in a deadly crash in Henderson County near the Union Line on Highway 60, with Randy Hopgood pronounced dead at a local hospital. Semi trucks piled up on the side of Interstate 64 in White County, Illinois. Law enforcement and first responders were busy. Uh, we're in an area that is conducive to getting some snow, so if you're traveling in and around the tri-state area, you're going to encounter some slick roads. This school bus slid off the road in Vanderburg County with three kids inside heading to school. Those students and driver were not hurt. Kids boarded another bus to head to school. Local deputies say county roads become slick when cold, wet weather hits. Uh, the county roads, they're narrow. Uh, they don't have large shoulders on them. They have farm fields. Sometimes water will come off of those and the freeze on the road itself. Making it tough for buses and other vehicles to drive on. Deputies are encouraging people to just be cautious. Please allow plenty of time to get to work. Make sure your windshields are scraped well. Allow plenty of distance between you and the next vehicle in front of you. And if you're approaching an intersection where a light may change or a stop sign, start braking well in advance of the intersection. These tips will keep you and those around you safer during icy, wet, snowy conditions. And deputies say they will be out on the roads ready to tackle any winter weather that does hit and are ready to help you stay as safe as possible. They did say to be cautious when you do hit the roads in terms of black ice because that's something you can't easily see. So please be careful when you head out tomorrow morning. For now, reporting live here near the Lloyd in Evansville, Katie Forcade, Eyewitness News.